The annual Veterans Day Parade made its way through downtown this afternoon. The parade started on the north steps of the Indiana War Memorial with a wreath-laying ceremony and a flyover performed by the Indiana Air National Guard. The annual parade included members from the various branches of the military as they marched along Meridian and per Pennsylvania Street. Uh, families lined the sidewalks as each branch gave performances. The city celebration kicked off last night at the War Memorial during a reception followed by an award ceremony honoring veterans of Indiana. And the 10th edition of Operation Alpha is uplifting spirits and smiles tonight with fundraising to help veterans and families here in Indiana. The fundraiser is at the Biltwell Event Center, and it's put on by Travis Barnes, a disabled U.S. Marine Corps veteran who founded Hotel Tango Distillery. Barnes says that it's in addition to liquors from Hotel Tango, there will be offerings from Upland Brewing, Sun King Brewing, and the Wine Group. Barnes says the money raised at the event benefits programs at HVAF Indiana, a nonprofit dedicated to housing, supporting, and uh, advocating for veterans and their families. Operation Alpha starts at 6 o'clock. The Dairy Bar at the Indiana State Fairgrounds was open today for a special Veterans Day event. The American Dairy Association and Indi of Indiana rather gave away 16-ounce milkshakes to veterans and active duty military personnel from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., according to the Dairy Barn. Uh, the first 400 people served enjoyed their shakes in a special edition commemorative Veterans Weekend Cup. President Joe Biden marking Veterans Day with new actions to protect veterans. He is expected to make all World War II veterans eligible for no-cost health care under the Department of Veterans Affairs, as well as expand coverage for costs associated with Parkinson's disease. The Biden administration is also unveiling new steps to protect veterans and their families from fraud scams.